it's uh, I think in July it's Tuesday the 10th maybe the 11th I don't know anyways we're in July um, been sick a couple days so uh, feeling a little bit better now um, just wanted to talk about this cosplay um, family that I ran into uh, back in 2000 I think 18 yeah 2018 I saw this cool cool Mega Man uh, cosplay kid and I've been doing different things with my um, film with, uh, instead of taking pictures I take film and I go around them uh, 360 and it's funny because I did it on this kid all this whole group gathered around to see what I was doing as I was going around and um, everybody wanted photos of the kid afterwards but uh, later again I saw him downstairs this was at Fen Phoenix Fan Fusion Phoenix Comic Con whatever you want to call it I saw him downstairs and I had seen this girl that had done zero cosplay zero but then she did a uh, Gemini the next day and so I caught her again Gemini no Snake Man so I caught them and I had them do like the the, the, the duel the duel um, like they were facing off and then I went around them and that was real cool but uh, the kids Mega Man always stuck with me and then I learned that the whole family was always cosplaying and um, I struck up a friendship with a couple of them on Instagram the family and well the two that are Instagram uh, the mother and the father cosplay Tom but uh, I wanted to start interviewing some of the cosplayers in Arizona a little bit about what they do and um, the family always cosplays together so I wanted to interview them and just get their little take on cosplaying and uh, this past Comic Con I was able to uh, interview cosplay Tom which is known as cosplay Tom on Instagram but um, here's the interview so I'll let you check it out and uh, also, I'm adding clips from the Mega Man from last year and the face off from last year so you all could see what I was talking about. Anyways, hope you enjoy this video. More, more interviews on more of the cosplayers in Phoenix and in AZ to come soon. Okay. Well, I'll ask you, you can just kind of speak up. So, I see you at a lot of local cons here in Arizona, always cosplaying as a family, and it just, I see it. I, it it's awesome what you do you guys do it together um tell me a little bit about what started the group the family to do, do doing the cosplay as a group as a as a i mean like my family we all have our own different interests so we all but it's kind of cool to see the family doing it together like, yeah. everybody you know so i want to know a little bit like what get got you into go cosplaying well i mean i think what do you mean I mean, we both, from the beginning, we grew up as geeks, nerds, comic books, video games, movies, TV, everything. It's work, work, we love it all. And she grew up with a sewing background. Her mother was a seamstress, taught her a lot of stuff. So she knows how to sew, she knows how to make props, she knows how to just be crafty and make things out of other things. So she's been dressing up her whole life, but I think we started going to cons and dressing up for cons about six, seven years ago, maybe 2013, 2014. And then these guys got a little older. Um, he loves Mega Man, so he pretty much the only cosplay he does anymore is Mega Man. Um, and this year we decided to get Dr. Light and Dr. Wiley into it, which, again, she made them both. Um, well, not the jackets, but and the hair. She does all the hair work, the big work is her. Makeup, you know. These pants, of course, made it. This whole Mega Man costume, maybe not these, of course. But other stuff. Yeah. I don't know, honey. What else, what else have we done? Is it done? Well, as a family. Uh, Castle Crashers. Castle Crashers? We Castle Crashers, which is a game on the PlayStation, Xbox. Marvel. Marvel, Phoenix Wright, Ace Attorney. Ace Attorney, yeah. Marvel, Marvel, Phoenix, Ray, Ace Attorney. Ace Attorney, yeah. We saw those before. Um, it's, just, it's just fun. Since we're just we're adults playing dress up, and now we get we get our son to do it too. Okay. Exactly. That's what okay. Cosplay is all about. And I follow you on social media, but I'm sure whoever's watching this, go ahead and if you'd like to share your social media. You all right. Um, no. I don't know if you can hear me. I am at Tigressness. Okay. Yep, she's at Tigressness uh, uh -huh. on Instagram. 
and I am cosplay.tom, but I just ride on her, her coattails. Yeah. She makes the costumes, I get the benefit of wearing them, but we like to have fun with it. You know, you post the superhero poses, but we also do goofy shots. It's, it's fun, so we want to make it fun and light. And we love meeting other Instagrammers too that they can take pictures with. I love seeing other costumes yeah. too, they're just so much fun. This is fun, so yeah. At Tigersness and I'm at cosplay.com, T O M. So is that, is that all you're going to do, Mega Man, or are you going to do any other characters? No? He wants to do the projectionist for Bendy. Yeah, Bendy and the Ink Machine is yeah. a game that is on Xbox and PlayStation. And there's a character called the Projectionist. Yeah, that's, a, that's a nice goal. He's, a creepy, he's got a projector as a head, an old film projector as a head. It's he's creepy looking. You might wear that. All right. And thank you very much, and uh, hope to see you tomorrow again cosplaying. And, I'll be here. Yep. So, you said it's fun. I mean, I could never get my parents to also dress up with my brother all together as a group. I mean, yeah. do you get slack for it? or? Yeah, I mean, there's certain people that just will never get an adult dressing up in a costume to go to a comic book convention. Um, and they just don't go, why do you do that? You put all that, spend all that money on the, the costumes and makeup and stuff. And I say, well, you love your football team, right? Your baseball team, you're wearing the jersey. You just bought season tickets and you get into arguments with people that think their team is better than yours, right? It's the same thing. It, that's their fandom is sports. Our fandom is dressing up in uh, comic book characters and, and anime characters. So, to each his own. So, it's all about spreading positivity and having a good time and sh sharing experiences with other people that share the same fandoms. So, whether it's sports, whether it's working on Wall Street, or whether it's going to Phoenix Comic Con. Being good humans overall, that's good. Yeah, being good humans to each other. Okay, that's good. All right, well, thank you, and I'll catch you again tomorrow. Uh,